So, John, what are the details of this plan? Well, what we know is that uh, regulators, including the central bank governor, Pang Gongsheng, called in executives from banks, from insurance companies, from the stock exchanges uh, into a teleconference on Friday. Uh, they did not announce this meeting until Sunday. And in that announcement, they outlined that they asked those banks to lend more to the economy, to support the real economy by financing uh, more activity. And they also asked those banks in, in sort of a contradictory way or suggesting how difficult uh, a task they have in, uh, in front of them. They asked those banks to also reduce risk outstanding in the economy. And this obviously comes after new loans in July were at a 14-month low. And so there is a real concern about whether the economy is getting the money or there is the loan demand out in the economy to get this growth going back uh, to a sustainable level again. So it's a multi-pronged approach, it would seem, John. We're anticipating now after last week's surprise cut that we'll see a mirror cut from the one and five-year LPR later today. Is that going to happen? So as, as you say, the central bank did cut its MLF rate last week. We are expecting a cut to the LPR this, uh, this week today when it's announced uh, this morning uh, with the, the issues that, have ha uh, that we've had in the property market, with the issues with trust companies. Uh, I think there is a lot that the authorities uh, want to do to try to stabilize this economy. I think we'll see that show up this morning with the LPR.